I just received the box full of American treats, which makes me so happy. I was expecting it. And the reason why I did this, the reason why I did this is because I have so many American snacks that I want to try out. But since I live in Europe, that's not always possible. But I now have ordered a bunch of American candy and treats that makes me so happy and I, I want to show you so let me just put you down, let me see, yeah, let me put you down here. And are you ready for the grand tour of American treats, American treats that I am so excited to taste and hopefully love? One of the most important items was Twinkies. I'm finally going to taste them. I hope they're as good as people say they are. I got some Hershey's chocolate. I love Hershey. I got some white Kit Kat. Can you see? It's white. I've never tried white, so that's going to be delicious. I also got some Oreos. I got some golden ones and some cinnamon bun ones. We do have Oreos in Denmark, but not these kinds. And I am dying to taste these. Ketchup chips. What is that? I have no idea. I will find out. Fritos. Mm, I love Fritos. Some of these snacks I have tasted before. I just craved more. Another very important item that I really want to taste, Pop-Tarts. So I have here chocolate chip cookie dough. And also brown sugar cinnamon. I actually tweeted you guys about how to eat a pop tart properly. And you told me that you either heat it in a toaster or you just eat it plain. I think I'm going for the toaster to begin with. And this is going to be super exciting. I have more. I have a bunch of Reese's stuff. I have these stickers. Can you see them? Maybe not. Yeah. Stickers that you dip into chocolate and they are supposed to be delicious. I got some mini and I got some more mini buttercups. Some more Hershey's, some more Kit Kats. These ones, Hershey's mini chocolate chip cookies. Mm. I got some Cheetos. Why not? And then last but not least, I got first of all garlic salt. Just because I don't know why. I don't know why. Don't ask me. I just got it. And then I also got something for breakfast. Captain Ah. I also got Captain Crunch because everyone talks about them in American series, in American TV shows, and I just want to taste it. So finally it is happening. I really hope that all of this will last me for at least a couple of months. But let's be honest, it might just last me one month. I will have to go work out. I need to go work out, like right now. So it's me five minutes later and I was actually planning on working out today. So before I leave, why not taste one of these ones? I mean, I've been waiting all my life, it seems. So this is happening. And I guess I just put this one in the toaster and see what happens. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing, but let's try this. Mm -hmm. So it's just one of these I think I'm going to do. Let's put it in the dirty toaster like this. No, maybe more like this. Okay, let's see. Mm, so exciting. <laughs> Even Zeus is waiting eagerly. You're so cute. You want a pop tart? You can't have one. No, you can't. I really hope this is going to be as good as I've been anticipating. If not, I'm going to be disappointed. Maybe do it like this. Oh, it's oh no, it's crumbling. So I think it's cooled down enough now for me to try it. So on camera, my very first Pop-Tart of my life. Mm. 
Hmm? Good. It is good. It's not like mind blowing, but I do like the frosting on top and I do like the cinnamon in the middle. It's a nice combination. Hmm. It just started snowing and I need to pipe up to the workout. Hmm. Anyway, so I will finish this now and actually go do my workout. It's now later in the evening. I'm in my pajamas. We all knew this would happen. I am not able to stay away from that box. So I'm going to try another thing. And this time around, I really want to try a twinkle because I've never had one. And that's what I'm the most curious about, I think. So I've already opened it, kind of. There you go. Let's try it. I'm very curious. Mm. Yeah, I get your point. Twinkies are... Did I call it twinkle just earlier? Anyway, Twinkies are pretty, pretty good. This one tastes like, I think it's lemon. And it's just a nice cake, a nice dough to go with it. It's soft in the middle and I like it. So I'm definitely going to enjoy the rest of this right now. Mm. So last night I craved a Kit Kat, so I had one of those white chocolate Kit Kat ones and it was really good. I mean, if you like Kit Kats and if you like white chocolate, I don't see why you wouldn't love this treat. So I loved it and I might also have had another Twinkie or two. I don't remember, I do, but anyway, I think I definitely have to go work out again today which suits me fine. All the sugar is kind of getting to me. I am heating up some leftovers from yesterday. So I thought that I would try and add this garlic salt just because it smells delicious and it would be perfect for this meal, which is saucy, meaty, mushroomy. So let's try this. I need to put you down. Oh, that's my pajama pants. <laughs> I hope you like them. Anyway, as I said, this smells delicious. We need to have this in Denmark. I mean, if I get addicted to this and I can't get it in Denmark, then I don't know what to do. Anyway, let's try and add a little bit of this. Okay, I think that's enough. Let's stir it and then, and then let's taste it. I'm pretty sure I will be able to taste the difference. Okay, so let's try some. Mmm. Mmm. I can definitely taste the garlic. This is amazing. Ah, I love this. I'm going to use all of this pretty quickly, I believe. And Zeus has gotten some tuna, which makes him super, super happy. It's Friday morning and I think it's time for me to taste some... Captain Crunch. I cannot tell you how many times I've read about this cereal in my books. So I think I'm going to do two servings because I don't think one serving is enough for me. Isn't this just pure sugar? I'm wondering if this is going to put me on the biggest sugar rush and then make me so hungry in two hours. I'm excited to see if that's going to happen. Okay, first bite ever of my life of Captain Crunch. Mm. Okay. Mm. I just bit my lip out of excitement. But it's good. It kind of melts in your mouth, meaning that there is nothing left in your mouth once you've chewed it. It feels like. Hmm, that's kind of interesting. Mm. Mm. It's definitely sugary, but I do like it. But I'm pretty sure I'm going to be so hungry in two hours but that doesn't stop me from eating this it is 
time for another treat. I went for this one. So here we go. These remind me of a Christmas cookie that we have here in Denmark and I just love them. That cinnamon really adds something to these Oreos. I need another one. Mm. Today I'm going to attempt to make chocolate chip cookies from these Hershey's semi-sweet chocolate chips. It has actually the recipe on the back and people have told me that you can't really read this just the chocolate, so you have to make these cookies in order for it to be the best as this can be, if you know what I mean. So this is happening today. I have the recipe written down in Danish measurements and I also had to halve the recipe because I don't want to end up with 60 cookies, which that recipe would give me. So 30 cookies is more than enough for me. Don't judge me, but this is my apron. Which kind of looks like I have to go milk a cow or something, which I'm not. I don't think so, at least. Are you comfortable over there? I think... Hmm, I've never tried filming while cooking. This is going to be interesting. Can you even see? Maybe a little bit? Anyway, I think I have to start finding all the ingredients. So, flour... Baking soda, I need to put you down. <laughs> Let's put you here instead and get rid of all of the crumbs. There you go. Sugar, flour, baking soda, what else? Oh yeah, butter. Okay, no, no. What else? Let's say salt. Oh yeah, this is extract. This is most of the ingredients, so let's just get started. Show, let's see. Actually, it's going to melt the butter because it's not softened. that oh that's good the chocolate chips are in the batter so now let me shape them into cookies and then get them in the oven this is what it looks like let's pop these into the oven and see what happens what Seuss is up to. Hi Seuss! Oh, you're so cozy! Mm, look at that fur! And that face! Oh, hi Seuss! Sorry, did I wake you? And you're not getting any cookies. I'm sorry, but no. No, you're not. I am so ready to taste these. Mm. 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 I knew it. So delicious. And the chocolate is Hershey's, which I don't, I'm not too familiar with Hershey's, but I think that the chocolate is 
extremely delicious so this was a success so now it's later in the day and I kind of need some salt after all that sugar. So I'm going to try and taste these ketchup chips, which sounds super intriguing to me. Mmm, mm. smells like ketchup. Okay, so here goes. Mmm. They're really good, spicy and ketchupy. I really like these. I think, I think these might be one of my most delicious items in that box. This is going to be my last clip because I have tasted all the things in the box that I didn't already know of. The rest of the things are things that I already know and already love. So instead of this video becoming way too long, I'm going to end it here and thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope that you got something out of watching me eat and try out a bunch of American treats. Thank you so much for watching and until my next video, happy reading. I'm just going to go eat some more of those chips.